like heck of hot. Hey guys, it's John Marie, and today I am dressed up like it's like really hot outside and I'm outside. And I wanted to do the about me tag because I did this video before, but I didn't really like, that wasn't really me. So I have a couple questions from people and also questions from the tag itself. So um, I'll put the link down below if I do remember and if you see me wearing the same outfit as one of my videos uh, I'm just trying to invest my time. I'm like really busy. So okay answer questions that are asked from people Most importantly, I want to give a huge shout out to all my friends who asked me questions at the ranch um, and some people from Twitter and Instagram and snapchat all my friends out there. Thank you for asking me questions But I got I chose five questions because I'm not supposed to answer all the questions just because 50 questions is too much for me So I'm gonna answer five questions that was from social media. So yeah, let's go I wanted to answer a question that was asked from IB Kate and this Kate with three E's. She's my mom But I want to say hi Kate. She asked me couple questions and she asked me a lot but I'm just gonna answer one of her questions or two of her questions it's either I answer two questions or one question can't really answer all of the questions but some of the other questions were asked already so one of her questions was who's your favorite five sauce member and if you guys didn't know I love five sauce um, but my favorite member of the band is Luke Hemmings Luke Robert Hemmings he's my babe Bay. He's amazing. He's a great singer. He's handsome. He's so funny and talented. I love him. So back off. I'm just kidding. Another question she asks is who are your best friends? And it says be careful with your answer by the way. Okay, bye. In parentheses. So I don't want to like make anyone feel bad because all of you guys are my friends. And if you're watching this video, you are my friend. I have so many best friends because like close best friend, I have a choir best friend, I have this best friend, a college best friend. There's like so many different types of best friends. If I had to say who's been there for me and is always there and I can count on, I have a couple. But for the people who I met that like I call best friend, it's because you guys are like the best. Like you are cool. I love you. I I might not answer this question. I could like Yeah, I might sound fake even though I'm not lying like you know, okay So I'm, I'm passing that question. I'm sorry Kate. So I'm gonna answer one of your other questions um, Best memory with Kate to be honest. We barely met senior year, but it felt like after I met her, it's like we automatically got close. Like the first day I met her, the first time I was like actually talking to her and being friends with her was in pre-cal, Mr. Allred's class. That's when she, like she was there for me. So I'm so thankful for her. She's like the bomb. And so the best memory I had with her was when we went to prom together. Um, we basically spent the whole day together-ish. We went on a limo, we took pictures, we ate, and we danced all night together. So yeah, that's probably the best memory I had with her. But there's so many other memories that I Love, but that's the one that really pops up in my mind. So yeah, okay So that was one person I got four more people I'm sorry if I didn't answer your question by the way So shout out to Aleli for asking me a question by the way I chose the people who asked me questions first if that makes sense Aleli asked what would you name your future kids? Um, I really wanted to name my kids Jordan because it's like it could be a boy or girl name like but now I'm like Acacia I really want some you know like tumblr names, but at the same time I want my Marie in it or like a middle name that's really nice. I like Elliot though for a guy because Mr. Robot or Barry. No, I wouldn't put Barry. I wouldn't put Chuck Bass either. Or or Luke Hemmings. Lucas. No, no, Robert. So it's either Elliot, Acacia, Acacia, Mackenzie, or Lauren. I want white names. If that's kind of racist, I'm sorry. My name is Jillian. Like you would think like, oh, I don't know. So I have three more people who asked me questions early, so I'm just gonna answer your questions. My girl Susan, who asked me a lot of questions, she's amazing. I'm just gonna accumulate, cause some other people, um, shout out to all my Snapchat and Twitter fam because you guys asked me the same questions as Susan. So uh, one of her questions that she asked me was the most embarrassing thing that happened at school. And to be honest, I don't remember anything, anything embarrassing that happened to me. Seated or selfish or like weird like I'm showing off like nothing happening to you but yeah a lot of things happen to me it's just I don't remember what they are I'm not gonna even answer that question because I don't even know what embarrassing means embarrassing as in like people laughed at you and you laughed at yourself or embarrassing as in 
Okay, yeah, I don't really had an embarrassing moment. People are asking me what's my embarrassing moment too. Um, probably not about school, but I have like a couple of embarrassing moments that I had in real life like outside of school and one of them that I remembered was when I was at church I was singing with the choir because I used to be in the choir and this girl me had a slide phone before so like it just slides and there was no such thing as iPhone so I put my alarm and you know you like you hit it like three times hit it three times snooze and then at church it decides to ring and it was playing Single Ladies by Beyonce and my auntie was like, turn it off. And I turned it off, right? And guess what happened? It rings again. Like, what the heck is going on in this world? Like, why are you doing this to me? I turned it off and all of a sudden it played again. But there's a lot of other embarrassing things that happened to me, but I'm not gonna say it. Cause one time, oh no, I'm not gonna even say it. Okay, another question she asked me. One of the questions she asked me that not much people asked me was, if you can use one makeup product for one year, what would it be? And that probably would be powder. And since I'm oily, I feel like I could live without eyebrows and all that stuff, but foundation is all I need. Powder foundation is probably most specifically because I'm oily and it works but yeah I'm sorry I can't answer all of the questions but here's one more person who asked me a question I don't know if that's the fifth one but I lost all the other questions that were asked to me I'm sorry um, my friend Josh asked me a question shout out to Josh he asked me what kind of camera am I using if you guys didn't know I used to film to be honest my little tiny secret was with my phone I used to film all my videos with this phone right here well the last phone that I had before I lost my phone I used to film like this and now I use the EOS Rebel T6i by oh Canon I thought it was like messed up but um yeah that's what i use so like i upgraded so yeah that's how it happened okay this is the fifth person i want to say shout out to octavio by the way thank you all of you the five people who asked me questions early because i answered your questions because you guys but this is a hard question and octavio decides to ask me what's your motivation for getting up in the morning and to be honest i wake up and i get right out of bed like i don't even have a choice i don't have a choice like i don't i can't even think i can't even have a second to think about oh uh, we gotta wake up because i don't have school but if i did have school my motivation to get up don't really know how to answer that question because let's see let's search up motivation because be a motivation. that's the only song okay motivation the reason one is acting behaving in a particular way motive motivating force pure reason What's my reason to get out of bed every day? I don't have one, to be honest. I'm sorry, I don't really know how to answer this question, but I don't have a motivation. All I do is, I, all I can say is, if you're lazy to get out of bed, get out of bed, you know why? Because if you lay in bed all day, you're gonna starve, and you're gonna get hungry, and you're gonna get lazy, and guess what? You're not gonna get through your day. You're not gonna get through life laying in bed. So get up and be motivated. Okay, moving on. Okay, we're gonna answer some of the questions from the About Me tag. I know it took me a while to answer these questions. I'm not trying to last all day here, but it's About Me tag, so it's about me. So. So that's the end of the video. Hope you guys all enjoyed. Please subscribe, like, rate, and if you guys have any other questions, comment down below. I will talk to you guys soon and check up, check up, check out my videos. Bye.